club muchacho Assorted flavors in these gelatos Inspire young minds and stack my nachos With the rock determination of a vato Run across the border with in his poncho Face like when it's possible Nothing start to the finals. Things could change direction here in game three. 2K Sports brings you NBA playoff action. In the booth with me, Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg. Good evening, everyone. This is Kevin Harlan. We've got the Washington Wizards facing the Oklahoma City Thunder. Taking a look at Oklahoma City, they can't panic, but after losing the first two on the road, you know, there's no question they'll need a win tonight to regain some confidence and, and make make this a series well their goal going into the finals was to get a split of those first two games on the road and they weren't able to do it so now the pressure is on them to really just win this first game if you can turn the series around emotionally and momentum wise now you got a chance to take control but well, steve if they're able to win game three tonight that scenario becomes a definite possibility they get a huge boost going forward the fans will just get crazier and more hype now a chance, courtesy of Gatorade, all fueled up and ready to go. The starting five on the floor. So on the floor for Washington. Wall and Beal together in the backcourt. Howard is out there with the prodigy. And it's Dean in at the three spot. Let's it go with the three. And it's good. Three points on the board on the shot from the prodigy. There's a chance he could have a big game if they don't D him up more tightly on the perimeter. Jackson kicks to Leonard, and that basket was going to count, goaltending the official call. He almost got to that shot in time, but not quite. You can't touch the ball once it's on the way down. A moment to check in with Doris Burke. Doris? Hey, Kevin, a bit ago, Scott Brooks and I were able to chat. He had an upbeat attitude when we spoke, especially for being down two games in the NBA Finals. He explained his demeanor, though, saying everyone expects them to hold serve in their building, and we feel we can do the same. Confidence not lacking on their sideline despite the deficit, Kevin. Thank you, Doris. Wizards have gone two or three here to start out the game. Wall passes to the product. And good, coming off the assist by Wall. And it's eight points for the prodigy. Well, he's off to a good start, and he's a guy who we know. I mean, if he gets going early, he can give you problems all day. Abaka sets the pick for Jackson. Right side, Durant. Loses his man off the screen and lays it up and in. Durant's got his second bucket of the game to go. For Washington, they've gone three of four from the field to start out the game. All passes to the product. Howard with a screen out of Abaka. In low to Howard. Passes it to the product. Shoots the three. It's rebounded by Oklahoma City. They come off a really big loss on Sunday. Yeah, I thought their defense in that game was about as shaky as it could be. At home, you know, that kind of defense isn't going to cut it. Never mind if you're on the road. 
they really look tired to me. And I don't know if they had travel issues or if they were out too late, but something was amiss because they had no energy. From outside, off the mark. I like the defense, guys, really getting a hand up and challenging shots. Yeah, Steve, lurking on that shot, and that was a tough one. Well, they just gave him two points. Defensively, you're going to have to tighten things up here. That's that's not a good sign. Now the dish to Howard. And there's the pass to the Prodigy. A three-pointer is right on target. The Prodigy's got 11 points. Yeah, guys, it's his consistent shooting that's really helped get his team into a position they're in right now. Leonard sets a screen for Jackson. Kicks it to Durant. Fires from the line. That one wide left. That's not a sight you see very often. I mean, he has a great feel for that jump shot, especially when he's open. Outside wall. The feet now to Beal. Here's the three. And Wall gets it to go in on the assist from Beal. Wall's got himself on the board with three there. You know, there's no better sign of how efficiently a team is operating than their assist numbers. And theirs are fantastic. It's just beautiful basketball to watch, Clark. Leonard, and he sinks the shot coming off the strong pick. Leonard's got his second bucket tonight. Solid screen right there that freed him up for the jump shot. And Wall takes to Beal, feeds it to Howard. And fouled hard that time. He'll get to the line and shoot two. Nice work to get inside and draw the foul. Yeah, it's obvious. The defense not going to allow many easy layups. That'll make you earn it from the line. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from for the Wizards. Boy, the three-point shot has really been dropping for them early on. Yeah, their passing has been terrific, too. Clark, uh, you're seeing a lot of assists, really moving. Got a flow offensively. I like what I see. That makes it 10 of their last 12 points coming from inside the painted area. Yep, that's something that the defense has to put a stop to. Maybe a defensive adjustment is necessary here. Washington with the ball. Tries again. Pass to Dean. Howard in the post. Defended by Durant. It's Wall with the drop. And the shot is good. You know, he was smart to draw his man out to the perimeter. He's giving up too much size to be effective inside. Agreed. As long as he picks his spots, his outside shot will be hard to block, no matter who's on it. Ibaka with a screen on wall. It's Durant on the wing. And it's off the back rim. No good. Looked like an easy two points right there. You know he's kicking himself for that miss. Shot denied. And they're able to recover. The Wizards working the ball around now. Here's Howard. And it's Howard again. Missing. And it's out of bounds to the Wizards as Washington retains possession. Here's a look at the 2K leaderboard with the list of the best shooters during the postseason. We take a look at Howard. Leading the league in field goal percentage, he always gets the ball. And, of course, the prodigy right there behind him. Well, these two guys are consistent producers. I mean, they've had excellent playoff runs so far. The crowds get louder, and on every shot, it's got to be hard to maintain your concentration, but these guys find a way to do it. Now, here is Ibaka. Bradley Beal unable to get his shot to go. Passes it to Dean. Here's the prodigy from deep. Kevin Durant with the rebound. Now here's Jackson. Dish is to Leonard. And unable there to get the go-ahead bucket. Washington's gone four of eight on their three-point attempts, doing a lot of work from way outside. Here in the first quarter, here's the prodigy, and that one is stuffed right through. Clark, the coach, was really passionate in that last title, trying to do everything he can to get his message across. You know, and I'm not sure what...